Guys, look what I did. Look what I did. Look what I did. Yay! The layout updates automatically. Yay! Um, anyways, we got, we got some fights to do and stuff, you know, whatever, right? We gotta go down to Salacian Town and stuff. That's, that's on the agenda. Has anyone ever used Kohl's Cash? I used Kohl's Cash all the time. What is, what? Of course, everyone uses Kohl's Cash. Kohl's Cash is great because you spend money at Kohl's and then they give you Kohl's Cash so that you can spend more money at Kohl's. It's brilliant, 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 brilliant. Oh, steel wing, sick. Um, so we can get something from the the Lost Tower. And by something, I mean, it's a Murkrow. We're guaranteed a Murkrow. I'm gonna keep stream on while I do homework. Can I help? What's what's the fir qu first question? Can I answer a question? Can I do some homework? I yearn for the simplicity of life where all you have to do is the work that you're told and nothing else. I yearn for that simplicity. Never be your own boss. It's English homework though. Ugh. Never mind. I want to do basic algebra. Somebody give me basic algebra homework. I'll do that for you. Um, we gotta catch Murkrow. That's um, that's the goal. Oh no! Is it Fodgy in here? Oh. I think I removed all the fog. Lit. Lit. Ugh. Uh. Ugh. You know what's really cool? Is finding every other encounter other than the one that you need. Especially when it's more likely than all the other encounters. So I think the rest of this stream is just going to be looking for a Murkrow, apparently. That's, that seems to be what's going on here. Dude, this is actually a joke. Somebody go back and watch this VOD and count how many encounters I got to get a 10% Murkrow. There it is. Yay. Hawkeye? I guess that makes sense. Uh, this guy looks like an E-lister. Let's do Kingpin. I can't get Unknown. Believe it or not, Unknown was banned. <laughs> I can't believe Psychic types got Psychic and Extra Sensory. Meanwhile, there are some types that are like, Please, sir, may I have a perfectly accurate move over base power 50? And Game Freak's like, No! 80 and 90 for no reason, both with secondary effects. Meanwhile, electric types, please, physical move, a physical move that's 80 base power, that's all I need, please. I can, best I can offer you is wild charge, buddy. You wanna hurt yourself? No? Too bad, die. Let's see. Yeah. We're swimming in dark types. Nips out for the girls and the boys. There's my bar blocker. All right, we're doing vulture. Honestly, um, we're getting a lot of counters to the Ms. Magius well after we've done the Ms. Magius. All right, we can do Scream, Deep Cut. Now what? Now we gotta figure out how to fight those two fellas, right? The Ace Trainers, Dennis and Maya. Oh, these guys are assholes. Gligar, Gyarados, Driftblim, and then Lickitung, Gardevoir, and Roserade. Jeez. All right, so we fight the dude first. He's the one with the Gyarados, right? God, I hope. He leads with Glagar. Word. All right. Ice nice beam. All right, Glysaur. Some of us have families to go home to. We can't be here all day, buddy. Just because you're unloved and unwanted, 
This homie is going for Aqua Tail here, presumably. Oh no, not an intimidate drop. Uh oh. And then we go to no, not you, Nebula on the water absorb. Oh no, did you get Aqua Tailed? Oh no. Yeah, all right. So you bounce. It's got to make sure that it bounces. Probably make sure that. Yeah, no, that's fine. And then we go to you. And this is definitely going to paralyze, so that's why we have the Lumberry. What? It didn't paralyze? <laughs> All right, now as long as we click the right button. There we go. Bye. Okay, so... Last is Driffy Blim. And now... Ladies and germs, it's Licky Licky time. Woo! It's a Licky Licky time and I'm sicky sick of this drift blimp, baby. Licky Lick, time for you to eat this dicky dick, baby. Ha 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 ha, knock off. Oh man. Okay, Air Slash does how much? That was a decent amount. But we eat those. Stop it. Stop it. Um, surely we survive a crit. No? Crap, we may not survive a crit here. But surely we can just go to Shocker. All right, Licky Licky, you have failed your first mission, which means it will almost certainly be your last. Manny to the rescue, as it were. Son of a nutcracker. Uh, good thing we didn't go for the kill there, huh? It's not Aftermath, it's Unburden. Allegedly, I'll be honest, I did not play around Destiny Bond, so. <laughs> I suppose a switch to the, uh, Skun Tank would be fine. Although a crit kills. Jesus. Why don't you come in and just finish this off? We don't need to stall it out. We don't gotta be here for ages. Bye, Felicia. See, it's unburdened, not aftermath. We're fine. All right. Well, that could have gone bad, but it didn't. <laughs> and good thing this lady has lick a tongue and not licky licky. Otherwise, we would be S O L. Good God, licky licky would overwhelm us to a comical degree. This should be fine. This is whatever. Okay. Yeah. This is where things get twicky. Twicky, twicky, twicky. Yawn. Just don't crit here, and we should be fine. Yeah. How much damage was that? Does it say 34? So yeah. All right. You just psychic it once. Nice. Zen headbutt, eh? All right. Well. Cosmo, you're the best doggy in the world. Cosmo, you're the best damn doggy in the world except Poppy. Cosmo. Cosmo! Oh, no. Uh-oh. I'm gonna be honest, folks. I was under the impression that Roserade would come out next. Got a bit of a problem now, right? Like, well, maybe it's not. Maybe we just risk the crit on... Maybe we just have to risk a crit on Skun Tank now. God. Oh, it'll, it'll stun Spore first. Bollocks. Well, either way. So we can kill here, but then... I don't know, fam. Do I die to a weather ball crit? 
Uh, only high roll, I guess. I guess we just roll it. Although, it's kind of hard to tell, like... Oh, no, I actually, yeah, I definitely bought a Weather Ball crit. But the thing is, is that it might not even register that Weather Ball... Like, it might only register that it's a 50 base power normal move. I think, regardless, I have to risk it, because... Freaking crap. Ah. Oh. I screwed the pooch. I screwed the pooch. The issue is I don't know if it goes actually if it actually goes for weather ball because the AI is weird about weather ball sometimes and it's not like poly matter like also poison jab is like a 38% chance to two shot so this is a bit of an issue. It could also just go Stun Spore here, but I don't have a switch into that either. But I guess we only need to what? Zen Headbutt it or Body Slam? All right, Skun Tank. Simply miss a Stun Spore. We are a uh, Poison Barb, so... We get the kill here, guaranteed, but... Um... Oh, no. No, is this how I lose the Deathless Run? I would much rather risk Licky Licky, if I'm being honest. Yeah, Licky Licky doesn't survive. Yeah, no pivot makes sense, because... The only one that I could go is if I think it's definitely going Scald or a Weather Ball, which I'm not even certain that it is because AI is weird with Weather Ball specifically. I could go Poly to guarantee Giga Drain, but the only reason that the only way that does any good, I'm still risking a crit on something. It's not Force Licky Death, it's risk a crit on Licky, but it's risking two crits on Licky. If I get full parrot here, then I go Licky and, and risk it. I think I have to try. It's a crit! <laughs> it should be fine. This is whatever. Okay. <laughs> Oh man, that was stupid. I just got lazy. Yeah, I should have. I should have stacked Licky. But I mean, no, that was really stupid. That's gonna make like Alakazams and stuff quite a bit harder. All right, well, it had to happen at some point. All right, um, we can get a bunch more encounters. So let's do that. Ah, shake it off. Shake it off. Shake it off, Flygon. Oh. What the f That's new. Okay, well, I guess we can't go down that way. So, all right, so it's gonna be Diglett from the Ruined Maniac Cave. Ah, that was quick. Okay. Is Holy Moly an actual character? Whoa, really? Holy Moly came from Captain Marvel? Isn't there a lady called like Dust or something? Yep, there we go. I don't want it if it ain't thick fat. <laughs> we do the bouncing boys, spider ham and whatever Iggly buff was. Was that Mary Jane? Because she was like, oh, that's adorable. The romance of a lifetime. Own tempo instead of thick fat. Well, whatever. Let's just go and get the choice scarf. All right, we got charge the, the, the scarf. All right, we're off. Now it's just Maylene. So we got a choice scarf and a choice band to play with, as well as some focus size, some life orbs. So we may be able to put a bit something something together for this quote unquote Maylene lady. So now we import and it's time for 14 year olds on YouTube's least favorite part of the stream. It's time for calc time. I got Maylene has Medicham, Ma Champ, Life Orb, 
Infernape, Toxicroak, Gallade, and uh, Lucario with a Focus Sash. Having recently found out that we cannot simply one-shot this, stupid Murkrow, you're so stupid. Look at this, you stupid idiot. Oh! Is there anybody that one-shots Medicham? I would imagine you don't outspeed, yep. We could bait high jump kick and then shadow claw or shadow sneak, I suppose. That could be fun. So that's one, one option. Also, Loki, we could just shadow claw or protect and then switch to the ghost. Wait, is Altaria really minus special attack? You've gotta be kidding me. You've gotta be kidding me. Look at, what if this was 15? <laughs> Shoulda, woulda, coulda. This brings out Lucas Ario, which you never want to see. Like, what type combination resists both of those? This? Okay, flamethrower kills, but of course, it's got the focus sash. Who has fake out? Shiftry? Shiftry, fake out. This comes in. We get this. Let's say we get this. That brings in you. We could stall out close combat by switching between you... Yeah, and it'll be poisoned. Ah, uh, we can't reliably stall that out. We could stall out close combat though. It's only five PP. Doesn't Altaria just beat Machamp? Sorta. Yeah, I suppose. We can teach this fella Roost as well, huh? So then all that's left is what? Croak, Gallade, and Fella. So Croak, it always DPs, so we can go between Mawile and Bane it until it runs out of either DP or... Wait, what is it gonna go to into Bane it? It could go Ice Punch. But then it's Infernape and Gallade. How the f do I deal with Infernape? That honestly might be like sack something and then just Brave Bird it or something, but we don't have speed. Stall it out with Rest, like just straight up Rest Spam and let it kill itself with Life Orb. Yeah, I don't hate that. So then last is you, but with Drain Punch and Zen Headbutt, we can stall with Bayonet and Houndoom. Okay, okay. So we might actually be able to do this. We even have one extra slot for either Infernape or to better deal with the combo of Luke plus Medicham. Zero attack, IV, Doug Trio. Oh God, this is so ugly. This is so icky. I hate this. God, these attack IVs are real, a real kick in the pants. I think we have like a combined attack IV of 12. What is Glalie's? Glalie's is eight. Bainit's is seven. Shiftry's is 20, okay. Doug Trio's is literally zero. Altaria's special attack is one. Mawile's is three. Jesus. I can never really, like, understand the depth of this dumb gym. Like, what? Okay. All right, Maylene. Who's ready? Who's feeling it in their bones, chat? I don't know, Maylene. We simply do not know. Medicham. So, it should always see the kill with high jump kick. So it shouldn't want to go for fake out. It should just want to try and do jump kick. Uh, Glalie learns Protect by level up, so we can Protect here. It'll take 50%-ish from High Jump Kick. Yep. Great. Citrus Berry means that this next thing won't kill it, but that's okay. Um, now we go Gwen and it's gonna crash again. It doesn't die here, but it does make Maylene waste her uh, full restore, I guess. So that's nice. And uh, Shadow Sneak is a two shot. Priority choice banded Shadow Sneak. Okay, um, so that's Medicham. One down, Ego and Gwen at 40. Okay, this brings out Luke. So this has to go Dark Pulse or uh, Steel Flash Cannon, whatever, doesn't really matter. We go Vulture here. He's got a Focus Sash. Um, so Flash Cannon crit will kill, but ideally good. It goes Dark Pulse, that's great. Um, so that does friggin' nothing. Um, so now we just fake out here.
So guaranteeing it to have gone, if we had known that it would absolutely always go Dark Pulse, then we could have used Town Doom here. But since now it's going Dark, it should just go Aurasphere, which does give me a safe switch back into Gwen. But it doesn't really matter because I just go Dust anyways. And I don't believe it matters here. Got a Focus Sash, Aurasphere, and Flash Cannon, both just straight up kill, unless it low rolls, I guess. But we got the Focus Sash. Good job, Vulture. We go Dust. Um, great. Our sphere. We got the focus sash. Oh wow! Ha! And they said dust couldn't do sh. Yeah. All right. Well, here's the thing: with zero IVs in our attack stat, there is one low roll that even with the fake out chip, earthquake doesn't kill. So dust. Are you gonna be a piece of crap? Or are you gonna help us out here, buddy? You are indeed going to not be a piece of crap. Good job, Dust. I'm proud of you, King. Queen, excuse me. All right, so now we got Croak. So our bestest bet here, actually what would be great is to go Bayonet here. Um, but I think we have to go Mawile because I do not want Bayonet taking poison damage from Poison Jab. We gotta go Iron Man and hope that it doesn't crit high roll Drain Punch. It should just go Sucker Punch, but maybe it doesn't, I don't know. And the reason we can't just kill is because it has Sucker Punch, but obviously it could've, we could've lived that. Um, okay, no crit, so that's fine. Actually, Earthquake would've just one shot. So that's a bit of a bummer. That's fine. Um, okay, so now it's definitely going Drain Punch and or Sucker Punch. We gotta count, uh, count stuff now, though. Uh, drain Punch, Sucker Punch, Poison Jab, and Ice Punch. Yeah, there it is. Bound to happen eventually. That's fine, though. So this will be the 10th one, and we can go to Glalie. Or do we even want to do that? Is there a way to stall it out completely? All right. What if I disable? Because then we're still risking a crit with fire punt. Like, we're still risking one crit either way. Honestly, I think if I think if Infernape, I don't want to say this too loud, but I think if Infernape crits Altaria, we just wipe. Oh yeah, but I can I can stall out. I can stall out close combat. Yeah. So if it crits, if it crits on the first one, then I just stall it out. Yeah. 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 Okay. All right. What if it burns me? I think, I mean, the double crit is just so much less likely. I have to just let that happen. One close combat. So I could stall another one out by going to Gwen and then going Moon Dragon, and it'll always go a flamethrower. But if it burns and I lose leftovers chip, either way, it doesn't matter. I'm still risking a crit. Yeah, let's just go Moon Dragon. One fourteen down to seventy-seven. So what's that? Thirty-seven. So we're good to all but two high rolls. Now we simply roost. Um, although it's at minus one. Minus one. It'll be at minus two. No, but we need to uh we need to be at full HP 
to deal with uh, the Machamp, which does come out next, though. So, oh, it's gonna flinch. It's gonna flinch. No? Okay, I don't know why it went Rock Slide. That's super chill. Just going random move. When do we kill? When do we kill? When do we kill? But uh, 70% now? What is it doing? That's at 60% ish. So Moonblast kills from here. I think that's always good. Okay, whatever. All right, Infernape. I mean, <laughs> whatever. <laughs> Maybe the fairy typing confuses him? I don't I don't know. It's probably gonna just protect, but I don't even care. Do I? Ooh yikes, yo, close combat crit kills with a high roll. Oh with most high rolls, Jesus. Actually, yeah, no, it just straight up Oh never mind. We're at 116. No, what? How does this Oh, oh, I was looking at the wrong damage. Yeah, so two high rolls kill this from full HP, so I'm inclined to roost twice, let the poison damage build up. We're not flying type in this game, so it doesn't matter with the calc. We're still... Yeah, I guess it could paralyze me. Go close combat. Don't do this thunder punch bullshit. Thank you. All right, that should be enough. Now the damage roll is 89.7% minimum, and it's taken two, chick, uh, two ticks of toxic. Oh, so we always kill, allegedly. Okay, we did it. We didgery did it. We're faster. We can just roost up. Probably just set up light screen. Yeah. I don't care. Physical Arteria, baby. Damn it. All right, we win. Didn't do anything now. Oh, come on. Come on, Maylene. You really gonna do me like that? Yeah, this isn't a this isn't a guaranteed three shot. In fact, it's a very low chance of three shotting. Was that two Zen headbutts? Stall it out until it misses or the reflect wears off. Four. Or it crits. If that happens, we we bounce. Fives and headbutts. It's a crit. Oh, nice. Look at that. Right on time. A little scary, but we did it. We did it. Okay. Man, I can't believe I lost a Pokemon to a random trainer. Those stupid ace trainers, man. Those stupid ace trainers. That's four gym badges, though. And we're basically deathless. It doesn't, it doesn't count. The other one doesn't count. Right. This should be fine. This is whatever. Okay.